So this is our first day here and this is my first haul of the trip. We went to Poundland and the reason we went there before any place else is because we were on the side of town that we knew we weren't going to be back on and you would think they would have more Poundlands around than they do but they're just not in the areas that we're going to be going in. So we took advantage of it. We went to Poundland. I could have bought more. I did good though. I, I, I bought some good stuff. Uh, we bought these tracker bars because I've never heard of them before. Uh, we have the crunchy peanut and the chocolate chip. And then uh, we they have Nestle Quick bars, which I think is totally cool because we love Nestle Quick, but we don't have bars. And then they have um, Nestle Lion breakfast cereal bars, and they say they're new. And then they have these Nestle Curiously Cinnamon breakfast cereal bars, which look neat. Um, then Kevin has tried a lot of pot noodles on his lunchtime review channel. These are called pot pasta and pot rice. The pot pasta he bought, he bought the macaroni and cheese, the beefy bolognese, and the creamy carbonara and then the uh, pot rice that he bought is the chicken teriyaki now they did have a curry one and he did not get the curry because he we're not into curry we just really don't care for curry then they have a vote to keep me contest going on with cadbury dairy milk they have the simply the zest the chocolate and the uh, the raspberry shortcake. So I bought one of each, and you're supposed to vote for whichever one you want to keep. And then I have never heard of these. I don't even know what to expect. These are called Twin Peaks. Um, it says milk chocolate. This one is fruit and nut. So it has milk chocolate with fruit, nut, and nougat. Um, so we have a fruit and nut. We have honeycomb crisp. We have... Uh, just almond and honey nougat. Then we have dark chocolate and white chocolate. So those are the only ones I saw. I bought one of each. And then lastly, we have some new Haribo. Uh, this one is a limited edition. We have tried some of the Tang Fastics, but we haven't had the Wild Berry that I remember. So we bought the Wild Berry. These are new. They're called Squidgelets and uh, a soft mix of squidge it says and they sound really good and then these are haribo jelly beans and this is just this is a new mix of jelly beans i don't know if we've ever had the haribo jelly beans anyway but this is new to us because it's a new mix so that is my first haul of the trip at Sainsbury, we only bought two things. We bought some Walker's Mac Strong, perfect with beer, it says, hot chicken wings. I know we haven't tried those. We also bought some Mr. Kipling Viennese Whirls, which we've had, and uh, we'll enjoy these in the room. Um, and then at Tesco, we bought uh, some Tesco chunky chocolate cookies and some peanut cookies. We will be reviewing those. And then to just enjoy in the room, we bought some Mr. Kipling uh, Bramley Apple Pies. Kevin loves those. We bought some mini Battenbergs and some Cherry Bakewells. So uh, the, all the Mr. Kipling that we found, they're, they're, none of them are new to us. So we'll just be able to enjoy those for breakfast or whenever. These are new. We'll be reviewing these. These are Gray's Honey with whole oats, protein oat bites, and the cocoa vanilla protein bites. I need to look these up to make sure they don't make any other um, varieties. That These are the only ones that Tesco had. And then at M&S, we bought some mints. They had the Polo brand, but these were next to them and they were cheaper. They're the, the Marks and Spencer brand. And they were like 20p cheaper, so I just bought those instead of Polo. I've had all these before. The... Um, uh, millionaire shortbread, the Belgian chocolate flapjack, and the salted caramel hazelnut. This is, instead of me eating a candy bar in the room or something like that, I can enjoy those in the room. Um, then we bought, I do not think we've had these, um, but we need to look it up, honestly. Kevin left his phone in the room, but I don't think we've had these. These are the like their, their summer flavors. This is the jalapeno nacho uh, I think they're all ridge cut. Jalapeno nacho, habanero hot wings, Asian barbecue pulled pork, and chicken katsu curry. I don't think we've had any of those. They don't sound familiar at all. And then we bought the Belgian chocolate marzipan balls and the Belgian milk chocolate wafer bites. 
we bought the milk chocolate salted caramel mini whips they had just the milk chocolate mini whips and i did not get those because they're just like this but they're instead of caramel they're just regular they had some cookie dough bites some milk chocolate sea salt fudge bites some honeycomb milk chocolate with honeycomb and chocolate coated peanut butter and caramel chunks and then we bought a diet coke there it was the same price as it is in the hotel vending machine it was one pound 60 and we also bought one i haven't been showing you ones we bought from the vending machine but we also bought one from the vending machine here as well at Sainsbury's, we actually bought two Diet Cokes, but we've been drinking on one. Uh, we found this exotic mango Diet Coke. We will do a review of that here in the room, as well as the Coca-Cola Energy, and there's a No Sugar Energy. So we'll do all three of those uh, in, in the room, the review, uh, while they're cold. Um, at Harrods, we found these uh, chips. Uh, these are Saver Smith's. And this is Wagyu beef and honey mustard and truffle and rosemary and Italian cheese and port. And they're all potato crisps. And they, the bags are really cool bags. And then at a place you won't be expecting at all, <laughs> at the Victoria and Albert Museum in the gift shop, they have like a food section. And these are called Soffles Pita Chips. And uh, they're all natural oven roasted. And so I figured, when else am I going to ever see these Soffles Pita Chips again? So I bought them. Uh, we have the cheese and spring onion, the rosemary and thyme, and the chili garlic. At Tesco, we bought these Gray's Protein Bites. They might make more, but we only saw these at the Tesco where we were at. This is the banana and oats, the cocoa, vanilla, and the just banana. Um, and then we bought, we actually bought two uh, Diet Cokes. We've already finished one. Uh, we bought a vanilla Coke Zero, and, or Zero Sugar, and a twisted strawberry No Sugar. And then Kevin got two of the Oasis Summer Fruits, because we really like those. And then we were in Hyde Park, and they had like this little cafe place in Hyde Park. And we went in there to get a drink, which you don't see here, but it was a Diet Coke. And uh, these are the London Crisp Company. We've never tried them, so we bought these. They're sea salt and malt vinegar, um, sea salt, and cheese and onion. At Selfridges, we bought four candy bars. We bought a milk chocolate, orange milk chocolate, white chocolate, and salted caramel milk chocolate. The only one that they had that we did not get was the dark chocolate, just because we're not that into dark chocolate. And these were three pounds a piece. So why spend the three pounds if we're not going to really enjoy it? Uh, also at Selfridges, we bought these natural and delicious brown bag crisps. These are the sea salt and malt vinegar, the oak smoked chili, the West Country Farmhouse Cheddar and Onion, and the Smoked Bacon. At Tesco, we bought the new McVitie's Moments Salted Caramel Billionaire and Chalky Honeycomb Crunch. Um, then we bought these new Pringles Rice Fusion. This is Peking Duck. Peking. Peking Duck. <laughs> uh, Indian Tandoori Chicken, Japanese Barbecue Teriyaki, and Malaysian Red Curry. And then Pe the Peking Duck is cute. Peking. Peking. Peking duck. A Peking duck. <laughs> um, he's peeking. Okay. And then at Boots, we bought the rest of the stuff at Boots. These are actually Boots brand. They're Boots Shapers. We have the uh, chocolate mint, the salted caramel, the blueberry yogurt, and uh, honeycomb nougat, and strawberry. All of these are nougat bars. Then we bought the Livia's Million Squares. Um, we bought three million squares and then one's called Bissy Bombs. I have no idea. Or Bicky Bombs. I have no idea. There's a salted caramel. This one is chocolate orange. This one is salted caramel. This one is salted peanut butter. So, uh, then we bought the Fulfill Bars. The only one, these all say new. The only one I'm going to look for that we couldn't, uh, that they didn't have, they were out of it, was the one that said Hazelnut. So this one is triple chocolate. This is chocolate peanut and caramel. This is chocolate orange and chocolate peanut butter. So we'll be out looking for the um, hazelnut one. And then these say they're new. Uh, the Quaker Porridge to Go. They don't say new on here, but they said new on the display. This is the golden syrup. 
and this is strawberry raspberry and cranberry and these are mallow and marsh this is chocolate marshmallow bar coated in milk chocolate this one is coated in 70 percent dark chocolate and it is raspberry and this is vanilla and it's coated in milk chocolate and then we bought some uh, deodorant and we, and we just paid a pound for this because uh, we bought uh, brought one with us that was just it was small instead of bringing two we only brought one uh, so we bought that and a pound that's not bad at all at Superdrug, I saw these, uh, they say new, uh, new four cakes. I don't know how these are new Jaffa cakes. Maybe the, it's just packaged, the packaging's new. But since it said new, I bought them. So, uh, they're probably the same old Jaffa cakes and you just get four. I don't know. We bought more of these Fulfill Bars. This is the, uh, chocolate caramel and cookie dough this is the peanut and caramel and then this one is the cookies and cream and then this is the uh, one like I bought yesterday or you all will have just seen them I told you I got all but the hazelnut and they had the chocolate hazelnut at super drug so I'll probably try these together and then try this these this one with the other whips and then we went to Waitrose and I bought um, this I think it's Gylian. We've had this kind of chocolate before, but I've never seen it in a bar like this. So I wanted to get it. It's Belgian Chocolates Original Praline. And then Waitrose has their own uh, chocolate. Uh, they had the milk, milk chocolate with pistachio, almond, and hazelnut, and dark chocolate in the little bars. There was a sign that said they have white chocolate, and they had like a giant white chocolate, but I didn't want to get a big one, and they were out of the little ones, so these were the only three we got. And then we bought these uh, uh, kettle chips that say Virgin Experience Days. Um, so this one is sea salt and crushed black peppercorns, sweet chili and sour cream, mature cheddar and red onion, and sea salt and balsamic vinegar of Medina. The only one we didn't get was the lightly salted and Kevin said he'd rather not have lightly salted at all so we just didn't get it. I don't know how to pronounce this brand so I'm just going to call it GU because I would say goo but I know that's not right. Um, these are new and they're they're spreads and they they are in glass jars. This is a hazelnut and chocolate crunchy and then a hazelnut and chocolate velvety and then chocolate and salted caramel and they all just they sound wonderful we bought a mr kipling lemon swiss roll we have tried a swiss roll before but it was like a raspberry maybe but we haven't had the lemon and these were new they had a bunch of new things in these tubs but i only bought two because you can see how big they are and we don't have room for all this stuff so um this is uh, crispy and sweet mini millionaire crispy bites and then this one is crispy and rich mini cornflake cluster bites and I just thought that sounded good because it has cornflakes and then we bought some Quaker Oats uh, Oats so simple this is the golden syrup flavor uh, bars oat bars and then this one is the fruit muesli uh, oat bars and then this it says new naked fancy mix and you get four uh, raw fruit and nut whole food bars you get carrot cake lemon drizzle bakewell tart and blueberry muffin so i'll have to see if we've tried i know we've tried some naked bars i don't know if we've tried any of those flavors or not but i think it's nice that they put it um in like a variety box like this i wish all of these companies would do that at asda we bought a i bought a sugar zero sugar coca-cola which instead of saying coke zero they're saying zero sugar i it's a it's not the black label anymore but we can't find coke zero anywhere this is what they have zero sugar zero calories or no calories so i'm drinking this and then kevin's been drinking this summer fruits oasis zero is that all you have to drink Oh, we'll review some other. Okay, okay. Uh, we bought some of the, more of these Haribo Squidgelets. We bought three, and I will end up buying more of these. Kevin and I reviewed them in the room, and we love them. So we bought some to uh, give to some friends. And then I don't know anything about these 
candy bars. I'm thinking some, several of them are from Poland. Um, I'm just going to show them to you because the only one I can pronounce is Prince Polo XXL. This looks like it's Wawel Advocate, and I don't know about this one. I'll have to look up those up when we get home. These are new. They're McVitie's Digestive, uh, Digestive Twist, and this one is the Chocolate Chip and Caramel Bits, and this one is Chocolate Chip and Coconut. I bought two of the Cadbury Cake Bars. I bought some caramel and some milk chocolate. Kevin spotted these original pepperami. And uh, so we have original and hot. And he'll, I'm, I'm sure, yeah, he and Andrew will try those. And then these are new. These are Oreo Crunchy Bites. This is the original. And then this one, it looks like it's dipped in milk chocolate. These three... Um, cake slices are new uh, they're Cadbury dairy milk we have the caramel and then just the regular chocolate and then the raspberry they all say new these are McVitie's digestives caramel millionaire slices we have some new M&M's cake bars uh, we have Cadbury roses cake bars and the orange cream and the strawberry dream uh, Kevin found these two new Oasis drinks that we're going to review. Uh, this is the Spicy Raspberry and Chilled Cherry. And they say Oasis Aqua Shock. And there's um, Zero Sugar. Uh, then we bought these to review. These are uh, Coca-Cola Raspberry Zero Sugar and Cherry Zero Sugar. And then we're going to be reviewing these. These are Dime Donuts and Oreo Donuts. At W.H. Smith, I bought a Zero Sugar uh, Coca-Cola, and then we found these uh, Pepsi Maxes that we've never tried. They have the cherry, the ginger, and the raspberry, and then I saw these Polo Mints, and they had like a, a red stripe, and I wondered what that meant. I knew the white uh, label meant it was sugar-free, so the red stripe means it's extra strong. So, um, I've been eating the regular sugar-free, so I figured I would try the extra strong. This is a Fulfill Bar. It's a white chocolate and cookie dough. I don't remember buying this. So, if I have, I have, but I do not remember buying this bar in particular. Uh, I bought the two new Galaxy Bars. This is a darker collection, both of these. This one is roasted hazelnut. This is darker milk. And then the Walkers, there was some kind of deal. If you bought... Two for a pound fifty. Okay, two for a pound fifty. So, we shouldn't have gotten this one. Because we bought two. Okay, I like them. But Ke <laughs> Kev, we've already tried these. They're fl flame grilled steak. They're really good. So Kevin bought those just to have in the room. And then these are new uh, to us. They're the Max Strong Perfect with Beer um, Jalapeno and Cheese and Wasabi. And then at Fortnum and Mason, uh, we bought just these two things. Uh, these are biscuits. We bought the salted caramel biscuits and the flapjack biscuits. And these are actually in a nice tin. In WH Smith, we bought two Crunchy Bars and two Boost Bars. We're going to take these home to Andrew, actually. Um, that was in WH Smith. Also, we bought this Cocoa Orange Grays Bar. I don't remember if I don't think I bought that one, so I bought it. That uh, we bought four of these Bounce. Uh, these are protein energy balls. I'm sure they make other flavors. These were the four that WH Smith had: uh, almond, peanut, cocoa, mac coconut, macadamia, and salted caramel. We bought these three Grays Bars. This is the orange and uh, dark. Uh, cacao, the raspberry and dark cacao, and the peanut butter and dark cacao. We bought the chili and lime uh, Walker's Max Strong Chips. These are McCoy's and they're new. They're called McCoy's Munchos. They're tortilla snacks. We have nacho cheese, uh, cool, huh? Mucho. What did I call them? Munchos. Munchos. Muchos. Muchos. Okay, muchos. <laughs> Nacho cheese, cool sour cream and onion, and smoky chili chicken. Uh, then in Boots, 
we bought uh, I bought a Coke, uh, basically a Coke Zero for me to drink. We found another flavor, a peach, <laughs> peach drink to try. And then I bought these Naked Bars. I've tried a bunch of Naked Bars, but I haven't tried these. Uh, these are the Blueberry Muffin, the Bakewell Tart, the Lemon Drizzle, and the Peanut Delight. And then in m and I bought uh, one of these Leucozade. I don't even know how you say that. It's an energy drink and it's orange. These come in all kinds of flavors, but I wanted to have something to put with this peach so we could try two things at once once in uh, the video. So we're going to try those together. And then in the co-op, the only thing I found new in the co-op were these uh, Skittles fruits. These are Chewies and they have no shell. Um, I'm going to add uh, these, just these last things to the, our London grocery haul. Uh, these were things that we bought at Heathrow Airport. So even though they were from the airport, they were still from London. So I can't remember if I bought this Fulfill Bar or not. This is the milk chocolate and mint. I saw it and I just didn't remember that green color. So I bought one. If I've already bought one, then we'll just have an extra one. I saw a Boost Protein Bar, and I wanted to compare it to the regular Boost Bar, and we haven't had the protein, so I bought those. These are called Up and Go Breakfast Balls. This is the Cacao Hazelnut and Chia Seed and the Banana Almond and Flax Seed. Uh, then we have these Bounce Breakfast. They probably make more of these, but these were the only two they had at Heathrow that we saw. This is the Peanut Butter, and this is the Red Berry. And then Kevin... Uh, he had bought two of these pepperamis earlier um, in our trip, and he found two at the airport. So I thought that was pretty cool. He found the beef and the fire stick.